This is a tutorial on call extensions and to briefly remind everybody what call extensions look like. This is an example of a call extension that has a click to call feature. And you can see the, ad, the telephone number is displayed right in the AdWords ad. And if you're on a high-end mobile phone like an iPhone or Droid, you can click this number here and you will call that business's telephone number. There's also a Google forwarding phone number, and it's this 855 number here that is a number that is uh, randomly generated by Google. And regardless if you call that from a landline or if you call that from a mobile phone, these statistics will display in the, in the uh, AdWords interface. So we're going to go right to the interface now and set up a new call extension. You can see here that the we're on the Add Extensions tab and the Call Extensions drop-down. Hit New Extension. Your first option is to choose a campaign that you want the call extension to show in. Choose your country. Type in your phone number. And the next option are uh, the phone number options. So you can choose show my business phone number only on high-end mobile devices. Or, and this would be on devices like an iPhone or a Droid. Or the one I'm going to choose is the Google forwarding phone number that I just spoke about. And you can see the drop-down menu here uh, says a minimum of $1 cost per call. But Google has just implemented a new feature on this where you can actually bid on the calls, just like you would on the keyword. You can see here from the Ad Groups tab that you've got a new feature called Max CPP, which is max cost per phone call. And you can see that the fee is a dollar, and now you can actually bid on getting phone calls to your business. I'm going to choose that and then the next set of options are the high-end mobile phone options and you can choose either to allow click to call and clicks to your website so the phone number will be clickable and the ad will be clickable and if the phone number is clicked you, you dial the business and if the ad is clicked you go to the landing page like you normally would. The second option is to allow just clicks, clicks to call and not clicks to your landing page. So I'm going to keep that on the first option. And I'm going to save that. And you are ready to go. You've just set up your first call extension. And you can see here the phone number that I punched in and the indication that the, the 40 number option is turned on. And you should see stats in here very shortly on how your call extensions are performing. That's it for today, and please tune back to other videos on call extensions.